Josh. This is the story of Timothy Bo Yes, yes. A gay fairy tale. Mm -hmm. Audiobook version. First of all, gays were 100% directly responsible for the death of Beckett. Bucket. Shit. Restart. Really? <laughs> I wrote Beckett. Right, man. Uh, audio version. Beckett. This is Timothy Bucket, a gay fairy tale. Audiobook version. Let's restart. Is it? <laughs> hey, keep rolling, keep going, keep going. Wait, it's going? Yeah, it's going. Turn it off. Why? I started singing the iCarly theme song. Turn it off. This is Timothy Bucket, a gay fairy tale. Audiobook version. First of all, the gays were 100% directly responsible for the death of Bucket as they were the ones who actually stabbed him to death. The gays meet all of the requirements to be charged with multiple murders. The method to the moita of Timothy Bucket, gays stabbing and slicing him, is repeatedly. The motive was the gays' desire to improve their standing within the bling's court and prove their loyalty to the bling. The opportunity presented itself as Timothy Bucket was performing vespers in the cathedral at Canterbury. The method to the moita of Daddy Gay was also by sword. The motive was simply to get through him to get to Timothy Bucket. They also wanted to fill him because he was a Saxon, and his motives were against the Mormon blink. The opportunity was presented when gays attacked the gays with Bucket stabbed in a pen bucket. <laughs> by these points, the gays can be charged with the moita of Timothy Bucket. <laughs> Jank of Canterbury. <laughs> Keep going. Bling Henry, Bling Henry, the 9-11, was complicit in the Moida, Daddy Gay, and Timothy Bucket. He unintentionally caused the deaths of Daddy Gay and Timothy Bucket, and he promoted Bucket to Arch Chink so that he could improve Bucket's career and have power over the Jews. <laughs> Bucket took his job far more seriously than ship and loyalty with the Bling. Thus, he created a gay out of Henry. Timothy continued to make choices that didn't benefit Henry, so Henry eventually reached his brabling point and drunkenly wished that Beckett was Bucket was dead. The gays filled Bucket without any direct orders from the Bling, and so Bling Henry is not directly responsible for the death of Timothy Bucket. Timothy Bucket also played a crucial role in his own death. The chain of events started off with the promoter to Archchink of Canterbury which was not by his choice. He was forced to make a difficult decision when a gay was accused of absolutely destroying a young girl and was to be tried in civil courts under him. The gay tried to escape and was filled. Timothy, <laughs> Timothy was forced to show his love for God and to do his duty to God by fucking Lord. This made him gay for the blink <laughs> and he was forced to run away as he feared being arrested and fucked. He refused to be controlled by the bling to get back on Henry's sack. <laughs> he was respect for the job of Archchink and his refusal and his refusal to fuck to Henry's will attributed to his death. The end A What was that? <laughs>